All right. I'm asking you guys for some help because I had this furnace installed. It's a Linux. I'll put the mod. I'll put the model in the description. They had it hooked up here to this old chimney right here, which there's no liner in for one. There's no liner in this chimney. And anyway, the chimney doesn't go, it goes out, it's cut off. So it was basically blowing into the attic above the kitchen. Okay, so I, I noticed it this morning, a bunch of condensation on the windows, and it was leaking in my light fixture. So I called the guy, told him what was happening. He called me back. He's like, oh, I got all the parts running out the wall, blah, blah, blah. Well, they came and they did this. So they hooked it up and they ran it. It's probably about 11 feet out the wall here. And I'll go outside and show you. So this is the light fixture it was leaking from. Right up there, it's dripping right onto here. This window is completely fogged out. That window is completely fogged out. And this is what they set up here. Obviously there's nothing coming out, must have just shut off. But um, yeah, that's what's going on. So the chimney, which I guess they never verified, used to come out right here above this, on this first roof. That chimney there, that's no good. That's not tied into it. That chimney is strictly for the upstairs. It does not run all the way through to the bottom of the house. Let me show you that. So right here in this corner, okay, right here where this hot light is, is where the chimney should drop through if it dropped down to the ground. So let's go upstairs. So look at here, this is the chimney that you saw that's not functional. Okay, so this chimney, you'd think, okay, well, maybe it's tied in from downstairs somewhere, but it's not because, look, so it angles here, okay? This is just for, this is an old school. They used to have like a wood burner or oil furnace, nothing below it. Because look, we go here, okay, here's the downstairs. Also, it must be tied through into this wall. No, that's not the case either. That's a vent. Here's a closet. That vent I ran up. And there's nowhere for it to go. There's no knee wall behind there. So now, this whole area, sorry I keep blinding everybody. This whole area has mad condensation. It's super wet because it's been venting into here for the last two weeks <clears throat> and I'm just concerned if they didn't do it right so I did want to show you all so this morning this is where I seen it coming out of right right here this vent right here it was just steaming on out and there's one on the other side as well so I did want to I turned the furnace on so I wanted to see what the hell is that Oh, what is that? Anyway. Where are we? So this is uh this is what it's looking like coming out. Am I gonna get backdraft? Is this even safe? Is there gases leaking? This company's been in service for 30 years. The guy's pretty short with me. Um and I'm just not I don't know, look at this. 
Like I read through the whole manual and yeah, it's an 80% furnace. So those are usually supposed to be ran uh, straight up. And I mean, my windows or above the windows, at least above the roof line, but I'm no expert. I need, I need some help. That's all. If anyone can help me, that'd be great.